So how's the job search coming along? Nah, it hasn't been easy. Yo, just come with me to this meeting, man. And if it goes well, you can make this money. Look, man, I told you, I'm, I don't want to get back into that kind of stuff. You don't even have to do anything. You just got to be there. All right, listen, I'm going to call you back. All right. Trevor! A main man, what's up? What's up? Why are you so pissed, bro? What's wrong? You good? You want some weed, bro? You gotta do it down the block, man. Come on, free for you. Oh, shit, alright. All right, I'll see you, alright? Bye, Jack. Alright. Good luck on that volleyball game. Mm -hmm. You don't have to be so rude. Fuck that kid. Why do you even hang out with that dweeb? Uh, he's not a dweeb. He's a good guy. Wait, what happened to your face? Oh, nothing. I just got hit with a volleyball today. It's nothing. Keep getting hit by volleyballs. You must not be a very good player. Ha ha, very funny. So have you thought about what you might want for your birthday? For you to quit smoking? You can have anything else. Please, are you, I want you to quit that shit. Ever since mom and dad... Stop. You're gonna kill yourself. Please? For me? I'll quit. When? Soon. Ah, oh, shit! This can't be happening! I don't want to end up in the streets! Look, I'm gonna take care of this, don't worry. With what money, Trevor? Your job is barely enough to buy food. What are you gonna do? I don't know, Maddie. I don't know. But what I do know is we need to stay positive. That's all we got. Stay positive? I'll stay positive when you stop smoking. For tonight, babe? Wait, what do you mean you need to work? Hell no, 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 no. I want you here right now, 10 minutes tops. You know how much bread I'm giving you? No, 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 no. Right now. Now. Oh, kick your ass. Easy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Wait. Yo, call you back. Call you back. Call you back. Trevor! Uh. 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 You put your hands on Maddie again? You're not gonna have the hands to play yourself, you hear me?
Hey Jack, where where have you been? I haven't seen you in school all day. Wait, what? So tell me a little more about this guy. All right, so the guy we're gonna meet tonight is from Miami. And I mean, what does he do? He's a drug lord. Look, man, uh, I don't know. I'm I'm trying to get as far away from that lifestyle as possible. I gotta take care of myself. I gotta take care of my little sister. You know, it's not easy. He's a cool guy. We've spoken on the phone before. Shouldn't be a problem. Well, as long as I get my money. Trevor, you fucking asshole! What the fuck is wrong with you? What is wrong with me? What the fuck is wrong with you for letting that guy put his hands on you? That's none of your fucking business. You could have killed him. It is my business because you're my fucking sister. If mom and dad were ooh, especially dad, that asshole would be dead. Is this a gift I get for my birthday? Well, maybe it is. You're not allowed to speak to that piece of shit ever again. Fuck you, Trevor. You can't tell me what to do. And if you care about him so much, you stay away from him. Fuck you! Yo, come on, man. Let's, All right. let's get out of here. Yo, she should be fucking happy I didn't do worse. I didn't know it was her birthday. Was that really her gift? Nah, I got her something, but now is just not the right time. What did you get her? It was my mom's necklace. She had it when she was Maddie's age. And she gave it to me for my birthday. So now I'm gonna give it to Maddie for hers. I think she'll love it. Yo, so what's this meeting about again? All right, so basically, he wants to sell his product in New York, and I'm gonna ask for a profit. Look, man, I need this money ASAP, okay? Like, I'm not trying to be a dick to you or anything, but I need this money right away. So when the meeting is over, will I have the money right there and then? I'm telling you, man, once the deal goes down, I'll give you a loan. All right. Yo, I think we're here. Hey, yo, G, they're coming. Hello, gentlemen. Yeah. Nice meeting you. How you doing? Great. It's a nice jacket. Oh, thanks. No problem. You can have a seat. For either of you gentlemen a drink? No, no I'm, no, I'm good. Now. If there's anything that you need, please let me know. Alright. What happened to your hand? Oh, um, it was my sister's boyfriend. He was abusing her, so I had to put him in his place. Oh, please, please tell me that you killed him. <laughs> nah, I was, uh, I was kind enough to let him live. I see. You're a good man. I can see that. I can see that. If it was me, I would have had him fed to the dogs. You'd make the dogs sick. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. Okay, well, shall we begin? You want to expand your business out here, but selling your product in New York is really risky, so I'm going to have to ask for 25%. <laughs> Listen, numbers don't lie. And to be honest, I don't even think that you guys are going to provide me the numbers that I'm looking for. So, I can do 15. You said numbers don't lie. And I've never done anything that made me go far down south. Too much pride can get you killed. I'm not the one losing out on this. I can, I can get anybody to do this for me. You guys would be the ones lo losing out. So, what makes you so special? Like I said, I can do 15. I see where you're coming from, Mick. Okay, I understand, but as a partner of Stanley's, I've seen his work, and he's only going to build numbers for you. As we speak right now, he already has people lined up, ready for that sweet Colombian powder. I feel like a fair deal will be 25%. Ch 
you think about that, G? They don't seem that full of shit. I'll tell you what. Call out the percentage. Okay? For the first month, we'll sell your product with no percentage royalty. And if you like our numbers, second month, all we ask is for 20%. You got nothing to lose. Wow. Okay. I can't argue with that. If that's what you're willing to do, then I guess we have a deal then. Great. All right. Oh. You need to thank your friend Trevor here for having the business mentality. Oh. <laughs> Glad we worked this out. Uh, thanks. Cheers, oh. man. Cheers. Cheers. Hey, yo, Mick, your nephew's here. At this fucking time at night? Pardon me, gentlemen. My apologies. I'll be back. Yeah. What the fuck happened to your face? My girl's brother did this. You fucking kid. Do you need me to take care of this? Yeah. You need to take care of it right now. You, you show me a picture of him. Describe him to me or something. Hey, listen, I need man. something. I got you, man. I got you, Uncle Mick. This is him right there. That's him? Yeah. That's him. No, you're fucking kidding me. Is that him? I'm not fucking kidding you. That's him. Are you sure? Yes. Why? What happened? Shit. Why? What happened? Fuck. He's in my fucking office right now. What the fuck are you waiting for? Go kill him. I want to. No. Are you sure? Yes. You're fucking him. That's him. Are you sure? Yes. Do not make me regret what the fuck I'm about to you're do. You're not gonna regret office. it. That's him. He put his hands on me. Your family. Take care of this. You were the one laying hands on his sister, though, weren't you? No, what the fuck? Who told you that? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Don't you fucking lie to me. Don't you fucking lie to me. I'm not you me. put your hands Nick. on a man's sister, which is causing me to fuck up business now. Nick, Uncle Mick, relax. 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 No, shh, shh, shh. Don't, don't say nothing. The next time you lay hands on a woman, I'm beat your ass worse than he ever fucking did. Okay. Do you hear me? Yes. Yes, sir. Is everything okay? Yeah, sure. I do have a question for you, though. If somebody were to hurt your family, would you trust that person again? I mean, you probably wouldn't kill them, but you wouldn't have that person around yourself or your family anymore, right? Of course. With that being said, um, if you could just refresh me my memory, um, how did you get that booze in your hand again? Oh, this guy was abusing my sister. Yeah, real jackass, right? Yeah. Yeah. Would, would you trust that guy again? Dude, if I see that guy around my sister again, it's gonna be a life or death situation. It's the same thing I would do. Um, what was his name? Why? I'm just curious. That's all. Uh, Jack. How did he look? Can you like describe him? I don't. Know. He's a you know twenties, kind of shorter than me. He has a beard. Things a. Uh, Puerto Rican kid? I'm not sure. Mm. That's interesting. That's interesting. I want you to take a look at this real quick. <sighs> Tell me, do you recognize the person in this picture? You know what's about to happen, right? Hey, Trevor. Um, listen, I'm really sorry about everything. You were, you were right about Jack, and yeah, I was just blind. Um, I'm just going through some shit, and I know you have your own problems, but anyway, just thank you for looking out for me. If mom and dad were here, they will be proud of you. Yeah, just call me when you get this. I'm, I'm cooking dinner tonight, okay? I love you. Jack is family, family. I'm just letting you know, I didn't want to have to do this.